All right, guys, we're back at the shop. Uh, we got the old uh, short block torn down, and we found out what let go. You're not going to believe your eyes. Let's go inside and take a look. All right, guys, there's uh, there's my old short block, and you know, strapped down in that transport tub. And uh, look at this right here. This is the pile of LS stuff that they have here. <laughs> this one here is uh, going to the machine shop to get rebuilt. There's the heads for it. And uh, I understand this one right here uh, ate a valve and uh, there isn't much use for it. There's a bunch of stuff, ignition parts, camshafts, intake manifolds. But uh, coming over to my engine, okay, I'll show you. The number one piston has been removed. And now I can get a good look from, at the cylinder from top to bottom. And you can see how bad the cylinder scoring is. You can see it. If I could just get an angle on it. From top to bottom. Deep cylinder scoring. Some pretty deep grooves. You can see them there. This whole cylinder is wiped out. Yep. It's pretty bad. But now... I'm going to show you what let go. All right, I'm just going to bring this outside because the light is much better out here. But uh, check this out, guys. Here's the piston. Here's the piston that came out of the number one bore. You know, this is the number one piston from my Gen 3 Coyote. Look at that. This, the, uh, the ring land, the, the, the second ring land and the third ring land has been broke. You know, it broke off and... Um, you know the oil ring is destroyed i mean this thing is is just toast um yeah let me turn the camera around let me, let me give you a good look okay here's a look at the piston on the other side of the wrist pin uh this is roughly what it's supposed to look like uh, but you can see parts of the oil ring is just not there anymore and then when you turn it around here's where it let go this is what caused all the cylinder scoring now i don't know we've seen on the web these engines develop cylinder scoring um, for really no no reason at all, at least no reason that we know of. Uh, but this one let go. And honestly, guys, I, I didn't drive this car very hard. It's the, this blower install has only got about 1,500 miles on it, and this is what happened to it. Pretty unbelievable. Well, there it is, guys. A stock hypotectic piston in a Gen 3 Coyote that let go. Uh, this is a um, Whipple Stage 1 kit that's got a, roughly nine pounds of boost. Uh, this is a warranty kit with a, uh, a 91 octane tune that comes from Whipple. Uh, if you look at the, you know, at the previous video, you'll see uh, it appears to me that this engine was running very rich. Um, I don't, you know, I mean, I don't even really know what to say about that. That's Whipple's tune. That's what they give me, uh, and uh, they warranty the, the whole thing. So, you know, this was the this was the result. And uh, obviously, I'm going to have the engine fixed. Um, we're sending pictures of this over to Whipple now uh, to see what they say. And uh, you know, honestly, I expect uh, that the warranty is going to cover this. You know, this is this is pretty undeniable. So, uh, yeah, I mean, this is too bad. Uh, I, I this is something I really wouldn't wish on anybody. Uh, it just seems like I'm one of the unlucky ones. But nevertheless, uh, we got a much better engine going in the car. Uh, she's going to be built up uh, over the next week or so. So I got a lot more video to show you guys as we as assemble the motor and uh, do some other things with it. Uh, we're doing some upgrades. Uh, it's getting an upgraded radiator. Uh, it's getting uh, better oil pump gears and crank sprocket uh, and maybe a couple of other goodies along the way. So uh, stay tuned. Uh, there's more to come. So thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you later.